All right, I'm Norwood. And I'm Angelo. And, and we playing the band Fishbone. And y'all ready to party Sunday? started in 1979 in Los Angeles, California, and we play reggae, funk, ska, jazz, punk rock, funk, rock. You know, as a, as a young band with, with big ideas, you know, sometimes we'd, we'd reach points where, you know, maybe, maybe the ideas that we had were, we, we had larger imaginations than than the structure of the music industry around us. We were already a challenge, just being who we were as a band, Fishbone, being being a all black band, and then the other side of it, you know, as a challenge to people's imaginations, just simply being a band that played all the styles of music that we like to drop. You know, we didn't see anything wrong with any of it. It's just as we moved we began to see like, oh, we don't get the same things that these other bands are getting. You know, again, one, because of the eclectic fashioning of our music and other thing, it seemed like, you know, there was, a, there was, might be somewhere along the way. Uh, what the record labels used to say was, they didn't know what to do with us because we were black.
We came in at a time where uh, when punk rock was still really brand new, and so was hip hop. And uh, really, those seemed like about the last really new things that happened. But you know what? I like to think that, that Fishbone was the idea that put forth the involvement of, uh, of, of, of all sides of music, you know, because we're very fortunate to be able to actually come in contact with different artists and bands that claim us as a, as an influence. And, you know, it, it validates, you know, maybe the original intention of the band and that, we, you know, maybe, maybe we had a good idea somewhere along the way, but, uh, you know, so it's, 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 it's nice to see the growth. Like, like if, if the guys, when the guys from the far side come up and say, Hey, you know what, we saw you guys open up for Ice T, you know, at the Stardust Ballroom. Uh, you know, <laughs> didn't, didn't that, you know, that that's nice to know that we touched hip hop along the way. And those kids touched all manner of hip hop artists, you know. So anyway, it just, just helps, just actually helps with my present to know that along the way that, that maybe, uh, maybe fishbones imagery our our uh our our content or whatever maybe had a positive effect on the culture at large at least that's what people say to me i can't you know i don't know or not but nice that people say that Let's go. 